welcome back. So today I have a Timu haul. This is actually highly requested. I know there's only like 11 people still watching me, but four people want to see this. So I have a Timu haul today. I hauled them back in, I want to say April, and those were such clutch pieces for me in the office. And I know in that haul, I was like, oh, I can wear this to work. And I wore them all to work. So great workwear pieces. I also got some fun pieces this time around, but they fill a variety of needs and actually when I got home from San Diego, my mom's like, I need to show you all the stuff I got from Timu. I'm like, mom, I have a code. You gotta use my code. So she will be using my code going forward and I will leave that down below for you to use as well. Um, yeah, okay, I don't know where to start because I have like stuff and I have clothes, but we'll obviously start with the clothes. Um, in no particular order, but we will start with something fun and Halloween, a skeleton sweatshirt. I've wanted something like this for a very long time. It's always in my cart here or there because a few retailers over the years have had something similar. And when I was doing this order, I'm like, you know what? Let's just do it. I feel like I've been getting like one little spooky or Halloween piece gradually. And it's just gonna fully come together in October when I wear a different spooky thing every day without repeating. I think I can do that actually. Yeah, this has been on the list for a while. So this is not an insulated sweatshirt, but it is sweatshirt material. If I had to say, I would just call this thick t-shirt, but definitely warm enough for me to wear in like a jersey September, October. Like this will be fine on its own. So we got our rib cage here. Sternum? I don't know. My mom's a nurse. I might maybe should know this stuff. No, why would I know that? But um, you know, you got your insides right here. And then what I really like, and I noticed it at the end of the trial, I'm like, wait, there's the arm bones too. And if Hannah Montana taught me anything, tibula fibula, I don't know, but I do know the bone dance. But yeah, I just think this is fun, kitschy. You can wear it to the bar on Halloween. You can just wear it regularly. Um, if you're like a teacher or you work in an office setting and you do like celebrate Halloween and you don't want to go all out costume, this will definitely fly as your costume or whatever you want to wear for that day. But so cute. And for someone who loves Halloween like me, like this will be an any day kind of piece. Some of these don't have the sizes. I will list it all below when I look at my order form again. I want to say I probably went to a 3X, but this has lots of room, very stretchy, but the perfect relaxed fit that I wanted. Next, something simple. I just want like cheap shirts to work out in. So when I saw this tie-dye t-shirt for like $4, I'm like, all right, game on. And they had this in a few different other colorways. Honestly, in my head, gym shirts should all be less than $10. Um, just like something easy, breathable, loose. Like I can even cut the, um, the collar off here if I wanted to. Like that is my intentions for this shirt. So it goes from pink, yellow, down to blue. Nice and loose. This one I got in a 3XL. So with Timu, definitely pay attention from item to item. So if you're always a 16, really make sure you're checking the measurements on each item just because it changes throughout. So just pay attention there, but you should be fine. And I wanted a looser fitting shirt because like I said, this is gonna be a gym shirt for me, but it's also long enough if you wanted to wear it as a regular shirt like this with leggings and a denim jacket, super cute. Um, but you know me, I love tie dye. So I had to pick this up. Okay, this was such a pleasant surprise. I added this on at the last second. This is a corduroy mini skirt, but not too mini. Like this is a good length for me. Like I say, I like to wear some shorts under my skirts just cause the chubbin and the rubbin. Um, so this was a perfect length on me. Um, this was in a 3XL as well. I probably could have went down to the 2X, but the 3X fit fine. There are belt loops if I ever need to tighten it up. I just think this dusty pink is super cute. Gonna transition me from summer to fall. This will go with a lot of things. So get some bodysuits, your t-shirts, your crop tops. This came up on a good place in my waist as well. So very happy with this all around. There are pockets in the front. I'm gonna double check the website. If they have this link of burnt orange or a black, I'll be stocking up. I mentioned in other hauls, I don't love wearing jeans so that kind of puts me in i have to wear dresses or i have to wear a skirt and if the skirt's too short you know i'm rubbing so i was like i should be one of those long skirt girlies i don't know if you follow maxi green on instagram you probably do she has like 150,000 followers so like of course you're following her but when i think of a long floral skirt i think maxi green so i was like i have to get the maxi maxi skirt and i can definitely see myself stocking up on things like this and wearing them a lot and i already wore this on a night out in the city with my family and it looks so cute so definitely a look i can stick with and also look mature like i felt very put together when i had this on so um floral pattern stretchy waistband i got this in a 2x and i definitely could have went down so if your size is sold out go down because obviously you have 
a lot of give here. Um, goes down to, I would say, mid-calf, definitely past the knee, and then there was a little slit. Nothing crazy up the leg, so when you sit down, you're like, yeah, you are fine. Just a little slit for movement. Mild A-line, I would say it's more so straight down, but it didn't cling to anything. I do have a pooch, it didn't cling to the pooch. I sat it very high on my waist. Um, I paired it with a black tank top. It looked so cute. So very happy I have this. I'm actually going back to San Diego in a few weeks for another work meeting. And now that I have a feel for my office, I definitely think for at least the meeting and like the social aspect, like we're probably gonna go to Dave and Buster's or something, I can do this a white tank and a denim jacket like it's still covered up enough but still fun enough like i'm not wearing a lady suit so this is definitely an option for my next work meeting all right let's do my favorite item from here i have two dresses um this one i just felt so good in so again a ditzy floral pattern little v-neck in the front um i really like the color scheme on this so it's like yellows and browns do I have to say it? Perfect for fall, but it really is. What I love about this is the flutter sleeve. This is just so flattering, just flowed right off my arms. And it's not a skater dress, but it definitely fits off of me A-line. So again, a very flattering cut off the body. So it comes with a detachable belt. I felt like this really helped give me shape and define a waist. I don't really have one, so... You know, adding a belt always helps for me. If you don't want to wear a belt, it is more of a boxy fit. So the belt definitely helps. Uh, but this is just so cute all around. I just love how it drapes off me. This one I got in a 2x next pretend to be shocked another ditzy floral dress so this one has a higher neckline again good for work if you don't want to be boobs out everywhere but it's also not like completely covering you so a little um v cut out and it's going to hit around here another looser sleeve it's not going to be the fluttery cut like the other one but this won't cling on to your biceps i don't really like how that looks on a dress on me so just nicely falling off your arms this comes in at the waist and then has a very stretchy waistband so again a very flattering cut this one comes to about my knee so again perfect for work you're covered you're good but also could fly in a more casual setting um this one i got in a 2xl and i think it fits perfectly okay finally for quotes this one i took a gamble on and I still don't know how I feel so please let me know in the comments so this is their take on like linen overalls and the very baggy ones I know I see them a lot on Instagram it's very much like the farmer's market Vermont divorced six-year-old woman and that's who I aspire to be um so I was like I, I want to try these so it's a wide leg overall and then it attaches um via button so however tight you want to make it I did both and both looked good and felt good like one wasn't too tight and riding up so either work for me in the front i don't know if you could see the seam but the bib kind of meets down in a v shape right here and then it kind of billows out from there into the wide leg i don't know how i felt about this i'm one i've never really tried regular overalls all my overall items are dresses so this didn't feel too weird in the crotch part like i didn't feel like it was like being pulled up there and i also didn't feel like it was pulling too much visual attention which is another one of my problems so i felt really good i really like the wide like aspect of this i just don't think i'm used to seeing myself in something like this but they are trendy right now so if you wanted to try this and at a really good price point try timu see how you feel but i do think these are cute for like a little casual day again at the farmer's market no matter how old you are okay wait there's one more clothing item um fall is coming thank god so why not add another sweater so i got this white v-neck with this i would say taupe colored trim super cute a very open knit um you could just pop on a white or black tank top under this but i didn't feel like it was see-through but if you want an added layer of protection under anything white you know a tank top is always good um this one came to right below if you're gonna wear jeans probably right below the waistband so it's not gonna be like a long sweater that covers your butt and leggings this is definitely something you would wear with jeans or pants um i'll probably just wear leggings because Really, who's seeing me from the waist down when I'm on a Zoom call? And if you are someone who actually wears jeans, unlike me, this is gonna look really cute with jeans at the pumpkin patch. Oh my God. Yeah, definitely do this on a pumpkin patch day. But I just thought it was a cute addition. I don't have a lot of nicer sweaters. A lot of mine are just like smocks on me at this point. So I feel like the neck trim here elevates it a little bit. The front is an open knit. I wish I knew like sewing terms because then the arm is more of a diamond kind of shape. I don't know if you can see here. Yeah. So, diamond here, 
regular knit here. So a fun little design detail. This one I got in a 2X. Okay, so that's all the clothes, but then Timu also has like random knickknack kind of things. So I picked up a few of those and it was stuff that I needed anyway. So I'll show you what I got. And we will start with this. This is a makeup sponge holder. Please disregard how dirty this is. But I have been just resting this on open surfaces around my room, which is kind of gross. Um, so when I saw that this existed, this is still wet and enlarged. So even at its biggest, it's fitting in there. It's not touching anything. And then it's going to shrink and really fit in there. So the perfect little knickknack, like you don't think you need it, but it serves a purpose. Also helps me not lose this because again, if I'm putting it on any free surface I have in my room, I never really know where I put it. So to have its own little holder and then I could put this on my desk or something, I'm gonna know where it is. And obviously if you have your own bathroom or makeup station, it's gonna be the perfect little thing. So for less than a dollar, having something that makes you look like an adult, an organized one, perfect. Okay, next is a little stand for your phone. I've been needing something like this forever. I had one when I worked in the city in like 2016 um, and I just don't know where it's been. Um, so easy, just rest. Oh, Betty, rest your phone in the little easel part. Um, you can do it sideways, you can do it long ways. So this is good if you wanna scroll TikTok during the day. If you have kids and they're watching a show or something, like hands-free, just put it on the desk. If you are FaceTiming, Zooming, like just an easy way to prop up your phone for again, less than a dollar. Okay, these I've been wanting to try so bad and I have a $20 version in my cart elsewhere and I was like, I don't want to pay $20 for a piece of foam. So for $5 from Timu, I'm picking up the Heatless Curls piece of foam. I have yet to try it, but it's a piece of foam wrapped in satin, so already good for your hair. You put it on like this, and then you wrap your hair around it, sleep in it, and then you should have nice Beyonce curls when you wake up. So we'll see, I'll test this out. And it also came with the two scrunchies because once you wrap it at the end, you know, you tie it up with a scrunchie and you're good. And again, the satin scrunchies, so good for your hair, good all around. I'm trying to be nicer to my hair now that I bleach it. Um, and I do a lot of heat styling now. I never used to, but now I pretty much always blow dry my hair because that's the only way it'll look good. So I've been kind of abusing my hair. So this will be a nice way to do some curls without adding extra heat. And then finally, I just think this will be good for travel. So first I wanted to show you it all compact. Um, this is a like laundry bag. So again, easy will fit in your luggage on the way there. And then you can use this as your dirty clothes bag. It is huge actually. You can also just use this in your home regularly, which I might do when I'm not traveling so much, but like, can we see how big this is? I would say three feet. I'm going to go three feet, maybe two and a half, but pretty large. You could fit a ton of stuff in here so not just for laundry but even just storage like if you want to put your christmas blankets when christmas season is over put the blankets in here pop it up in your attic or whatever um just good storage all around but to me i was like travel and then it compacts down very small so you could fit a lot in here this was also like five dollars they also had this in a few different sizes so if you want to go smaller that's like three dollars if you want to go bigger that's gonna be like ten but like you could fit a lot in here for $5. And it's houndstooth, a pattern I love. Okay, so that is everything from Timu. You know, solving some minor problems around my room. I got some Halloween stuff, which I'm all about. And I got stuff to wear to work and very cute dresses. So I feel like I hit every avenue I wanted to when I'm shopping. And Timu definitely has literally every category of anything you could want, all at a good price. So I do have a discount code. I will leave that down below. They have an app, they have the website. You can really shop anywhere. Anything I mentioned in this video will be linked down below. We'll also put my sizes down below. Like I said, from item to item, check the size against your measurements and you should be good. But I know Timu is very popular right now. Again, if my mom has heard of it, it's popular. So now my mom can use my discount code as well. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you very soon. Bye.